Hi, Primary. We have been talking so much about missionaries. We've talked about Alma and Amulek, right? We've talked about Ammon, and we know that you don't have to be old to be a missionary. You don't have to wear a name tag to be a missionary. You can be a missionary when you're young, right? So this song is about a child wanting to be a missionary and thinking, I don't want to wait till I'm old to be a missionary. I want to be a missionary right now. So we're going to learn this song, and I need a few volunteers. So I'm going to pick Ellen and Emily and Camille and Sawyer. So they're going to help us learn this first verse. Ellen has a picture with missionaries, and the words are, I want to be a missionary now. Sing with me. I want to be a missionary now. Then Maddie's going to shake her head to say, I don't want to wait until I'm grown. Can you sing that? I don't want to wait until I'm grown. Do you think we can do Ellen and Maddie's parts together? I want to be a missionary now. I don't want to wait until I'm grown. Ready? Let's sing that part together. I want to be a missionary now. I don't want to wait until I'm grown. Good job. Now Camille has a sign that says young, and the words are, I want to share the gospel while I'm young. Can you sing that with me? I want to share the gospel while I'm young. Now Sawyer has a sign that says testimony, and the words are, For I have a testimony of my own. Can you sing that with me? For I have a testimony of my own. Okay, now let's sing Camille's and Sawyer's parts together. I want to share the gospel while I'm young, for I have a testimony of my own. Ready? I want to share the gospel while I'm young, for I have a testimony of my own. I think we got it. Let's keep all our helpers and do the first verse all together. I want to be a missionary now. I don't want to wait until I'm grown. I want to share the gospel while I'm young, for I have a testimony of my own. Good. So that's the first verse. So how do we be a missionary when we're young? The story in the friend, the story answers that question. It's called Eva's Scripture Pictures. And this is Eva. You can look while, while I read it. Eva loves scripture stories. Eva draws pictures of her favorite scripture stories. Eva draws Nephi building a boat. Eva draws Abish knocking on doors. She draws Samuel on the wall. Eva draws a picture of Jesus blessing the children. Eva feels happy. Eva puts her pictures on the fridge. Now Eva and her whole family can remember the scripture stories. Not being a missionary, sharing something that you know is true with your family, and Eva drew pictures and put them up on her fridge. What are other ways we can be missionaries while we're young? Can we... Do you think you can be a missionary even to your parents? My kids are sometimes missionaries to me. One time I heard Ellen singing Gethsemane when, you, when she first learned that song. And I didn't know that song yet. And I heard her singing it and I heard that it was about Jesus and the atonement and what he did for us. And it made me feel really happy inside. She was being a missionary to me by singing that primary song. So you can sing primary songs in your house and be a missionary to your family. Okay, we're going to learn the second verse. And I need some volunteers again. Let's have Eric and uh, Lucy and Oscar and Elijah help us learn the second verse. Okay, Eric is showing us how to tell our friends about things we know are true. So the song says, I want to tell my friends about our church. Can you sing that with me? 
I want to tell my friends about our church. Good job. Lucy is showing us happiness because we want to tell our friends about the happiness the gospel brings us. So this part of the song says, And the happiness it brings to me. Can you sing that with me? And the happiness it brings to me. Good. Now let's do Eric and Lucy's parts together. I want to tell my friends about our church and the happiness it brings to me. Ready? I want to tell my friends about our church and the happiness it brings to me. Oscar is showing a picture of Joseph Smith. So the words are, I'll tell them how the gospel was restored. Can you sing that with me? I'll tell them how the gospel was restored. And Elijah is holding up a Book of Mormon. So the words are, Tell them how the Book of Mormon came to be. Can you sing that with me? Tell them how the Book of Mormon came to be. Now let's sing Oscar and Elijah's parts. I'll tell them how the gospel was restored. Tell them how the Book of Mormon came to be. Ready? I'll tell them how the gospel was restored. Tell them how the Book of Mormon came to be. Nice. I think we're ready to go all the way through the second verse. Starting with Eric, I want to tell my friends about our church. I want to tell my friends about our church and the happiness it brings to me. I'll tell them how the gospel was restored, tell them how the Book of Mormon came to be. That's a cool verse about talking with your friends about what you know is true. I remember when I was nine or ten, we were at library in, in school, and we had some time after we found our books, and we were all sitting at the tables and looking through our books, and my good friend was um, sitting next to me, and her name was Mida. And she was from Jordan, which is over in the Middle East, kind of by Israel and Iraq, kind of a really far away place from where I was from. And we talked about our religions. I asked her about her religion. She was Muslim. And I asked her questions about her religion, and she asked me questions about mine, and we just got to talk about what we believed. So it's cool to be able to talk with your friends about things that are important to you and things you believe. Okay, last verse. We need some more volunteers. Let's have the Larsons and Davis, Madeline, and Roman. Gonna help us with learning the third verse. So this picture shows people helping each other, which is a great way to be a missionary because it shows what Jesus would do. So the words are, Then I can be a missionary now. Can you sing that with me? Then I can be a missionary now. Good job. And now we see the Larsons shaking their heads. I don't have to wait until I'm grown. Sing that with me. I don't have to wait until I'm grown. So let's do those first two parts together. Then I can be a missionary now. I don't have to wait until I'm grown. Ready? Then I can be a missionary now. I don't have to wait until I'm grown. Now Davis shows us, I'll live each day the best that I know how. Can you sing that with me? I'll live each day the best that I know how. Good. Now Roman and Maddie are going to help us finish the song, and it goes like this. And they'll see I have a testimony of my own, a testimony of my very own. Can you sing that with me? And they'll see I have a testimony of my own, a testimony of my very own. Third verse all together. Then I can be a missionary now. That's how it starts. Ready? Here we go. Then I can be a missionary now. I don't have to wait until I'm grown. I'll live each day the best that I know how. And they'll see I have a testimony of my own. A testimony of my very own. So 
this verse teaches about having a testimony of your own, right? A testimony is having a good feeling when you know something is true. So I have something in the friend I want to show you real quick. This is an activity from the June friend and you cut out each one of these rectangles and put them in a jar. Pick one out each day to do and they're all things that help you feel your own testimony. And when you feel your testimony, then you can share it. You can be a missionary now, just like this song says. So let's have all the helpers help again, and we'll sing all the way through the whole song. I want to be a missionary now. I don't want to wait until I'm grown. I want to share the gospel while I'm young, for I have a testimony of my own. I want to tell my friends about our church and the happiness it brings to me. I'll tell them how the gospel was restored, tell them how the Book of Mormon came to be. Then I can be a missionary now. I don't have to wait until I'm grown. I'll live each day the best that I know how, and they'll see I have a testimony of my own, a testimony of my very own. So keep being awesome missionaries by loving everyone around you and helping people. We talked about singing primary songs. You can t tell your family about stories you read in The Friend. You can talk with your family about stories in the scriptures that you're reading about. There are so many wonderful ways to show the light of Christ. And the song, Jesus Wants Me for a Sunbeam, Sunbeam is about that. Shining the light of Christ to everybody around you. Let's sing that one together. So next week, it will be Sister Blotter doing primary. She's our new primary chorister with me, so we'll be taking turns. And so that's who it'll be next week. To finish today, let's sing uh, We'll Bring the World His Truth. That's the Army of Helaman song. Because you, children, and youth are an amazing army of righteous people who can do amazing things. Every day, through the big things you do and through the little things you do. You can be an example for Jesus and you can teach people what you believe when they watch and see what you do. So let's sing, we'll bring the world his truth and then we'll see you next time. Have a great week. Bye.